The Haunted Hotel, A Mystery of Modern Venice, by Wilkie Collins is a riveting exploration of the psychological intricacies that intertwine with the supernatural. Published in 1878, the novel is a prime example of Collins's mastery in crafting suspenseful tales that captivate readers with its intricate plot and vivid characters. Set against the enchanting backdrop of Venice, a city shrouded in mystery and decadence, the novel unfolds with a mysterious death at the palatial and eponymous Grand Hotel. Collins skillfully weaves together a narrative tapestry that entangles the lives of a diverse cast of characters, each harboring secrets and haunted by their own pasts. The central plot revolves around the enigmatic Countess Nerona, whose past is clouded with tragedy and dark secrets. The novel employs a multi-narrative structure, a characteristic feature of Collins's works, wherein different characters take turns in revealing their perspectives. This technique not only adds depth to the story but also keeps the reader engaged as the plot unfolds from various viewpoints. The narrative shifts seamlessly between different characters, creating a web of suspense and intrigue. One of the strengths of The Haunted Hotel lies in Collins's meticulous attention to detail. The author paints a vivid picture of Venice, utilizing its labyrinthine canals and decadent architecture as more than just a setting, they become integral to the eerie atmosphere of the novel. The city itself seems to be a character, its winding streets mirroring the twists and turns of the plot. The characterization in the novel is rich and multifaceted. Countess Nerona emerges as a complex and compelling figure, her charm and beauty concealing a sinister nature. Her interactions with other characters are fraught with tension, as each person she encounters becomes entangled in the web of her past. The protagonist, Detective Dr. Wybrow, is equally intriguing, embodying the rational mind grappling with the inexplicable. The theme of the supernatural is skillfully interwoven with the psychological aspects of the narrative. The mysterious death at the Grand Hotel is not merely a crime to be solved but a catalyst that unravels the character's inner demons. Collins delves into the realms of the supernatural with finesse, blurring the lines between the natural and the inexplicable. The eerie ambience of the haunted hotel serves as a metaphor for the character's haunted souls, plagued by guilt, deception, and unresolved conflicts. As with many of Collins's works, The Haunted Hotel is a critique of societal norms and the constraints placed on individuals, particularly women, in the Victorian era. Countess Nerona, in particular, defies the conventional expectations of her gender, challenging the stereotypes associated with women in the 19th century. The novel explores themes of identity, morality, and the consequences of societal expectations on individual lives. The pacing of the novel is deliberate, allowing for the gradual unraveling of the mystery. Collins keeps readers on the edge of their seats by skillfully building suspense and carefully disclosing information at strategic points. The intricate plot twists and turns, revealing hidden connections and unexpected revelations, ensuring that the reader remains engaged until the final page. In conclusion, The Haunted Hotel, A Mystery of Modern Venice, is a masterfully crafted work by Wilkie Collins. Its combination of suspense, supernatural elements, and psychological depth showcases the author's talent for weaving intricate narratives. The novel not only serves as a captivating mystery but also provides a nuanced exploration of human nature and societal expectations. As with many of Collins's works, The Haunted Hotel endures as a timeless classic that continues to enthrall readers with its enigmatic charm.